Namaste. Please sit in a comfortable position. Keep your eyes closed. Take a few deep breaths. Let's begin our session with three rounds of Omkar, followed by the starting prayer. Take a deep inhalation, inhale. Oh. Inhale. Starting prayer. Sahana Vavatu Sahana Bhunaktu Sahaviryankaravavahai Tejasvi Navadhi Tamastuma Vidvishavahai Om Shant Shant Shanti Release your hands, take your hands behind you. Holding the right wrist with your left hand, make a gentle twist with your right hand as you inhale. Take your head backwards. And as you exhale, bend forward, bring your forehead towards the floor. Inhale, slowly come up, release your hands, and gently open your eyes. Please come to a standing position. We'll do a few warm ups. Starting with head to toe loosening. Bend your head, bring your chin towards the chest. As you inhale, turn your head from the right side. All the way back. And as you exhale, turn to the other side. Making a full, nice rotation to the neck. Continue a few rounds. Opposite direction, as inhale, turn the head from the left. Last one. So let's stop the practice. Bring all your fingers together on your shoulders and bring your elbows forward. Let's make nice shoulder rotations as you inhale. Take your elbows up as high as you can. Expand the chest. And as you exhale, bring them down from the back all the way. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Continue a few rounds at your own pace. Synchronizing your breath and your body movement. Let's do it in the opposite direction as you inhale. Take your elbows on the way back, expand the chest, exhale down. Slowly start the practice. Spread your feet about hip width apart and bring your hands in front of your shoulders, in front of you, palms facing each other. As you inhale, expand your arms, take them all the way back as much as you can. Exhale forward. Inhale and expand. Exhale forward. Continue a few rounds at your own pace, making sure your hands are moving at the shoulder level. If you feel comfortable, you can speed up. Let's 
slow down, slow down and stop. Bring your hands at the shoulder level, palms facing the floor, take a nice inhalation. As you exhale, swing your arms turned right twist, turn your hand all the way to the back, left hand to the right shoulder, inhale forward, exhale, swing towards the left, left hand all the way back and right hand to the left. Continue a few rounds at your own pace with inhalation and exhalation. And you can speed up if you feel comfortable. Feel your spine, feel the nice twist and turn to the spine. Slow down, slow down and stop. Sideways, take one asana, spread your feet about two, two and a half feet apart. Bring your hands at the shoulder level, take a nice inhalation. As you exhale, swing towards the left side, left hand on the left knee, sliding it down further, right hand all the way until the right bicep is the right ear. Inhale, come up, exhale onto the other side. Listen to your body and go as much down as you can. Continue with inhalation and exhalation. Inhale up, exhale down. Slow down and stop. Forward bends. Hands at the shoulder level. Take a nice inhalation. As you exhale, bend forward into a nice stable top position. Swing your arms, right hand to the left foot, left hand up towards the sky. Inhale, come up. Exhale, now swing the left hand to the right foot, right hand up towards the sky. Inhale. Come up. Make sure to bend from the low back region into a tabletop position and then swing your arms. Exhale, exhale, inhale, inhale. Exhale, exhale, inhale, inhale. Continue a few times. Slow down and stop. Relax for a few moments. <clears throat> Let's do some Tadasana breathing practices. Cross, make sure your feet are about hip width apart. Cross your fingers in front of your chest. Inhale, stretch outwards. Exhale, towards you. Do it a few times. And 35 degrees. Feel the stretch from your heels all the way to your fingertips. Take your hands all the way above in 180 degrees, up straight. 
Yuna is rich, as you inhale. Reach higher. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale and hold. And as you exhale, bend towards the left side. Inhale up. Exhale, bend to the right side. Inhale up. Exhale to the left. Inhale up. Exhale to the right. Inhale up. Exhale to the left. Inhale up. Exhale to the right. Inhale and release. Relax for a few moments. In standing relaxation posture, Shittala Tadasana. Hands away from the body, feet away from each other. When you're ready, come to the left side of your mats. We're going to do Chandra Namaskar Asanas. It's a sequence of different postures. We will hold in every posture and do it slow. So you can follow along. Inhale, take your right foot about one foot apart and bring your hands up with the palms touching each other all the way above. You nice lean your stretch. As you exhale, bend towards the left side. Take in third asana. Inhale up. Exhale, bend to the right side. Inhale up. Take your right foot out about three feet. Keep breathing normally. If I don't say anything, you should be breathing normally. Take your right foot about three feet apart. Bend your knees forward and your fingers in Chin Mudra. Like the goddess posture. Devi Asana. Back is straight. Bend your knees, pointing forward. Inhale, come up straight. And our hands, palms facing down in the star posture. Take a nice inhalation. As you exhale, bend to the right side, right foot touching the right ankle, taking the right ankle. You can turn the right foot 80 degrees. Into Trikona Asana. Stay there as long as comfortable. This is a sequence. So let's continue the sequence. Bring your left hand to the right foot and bring your forehead towards the left knee. Sorry, right knee. You can rest your hands on the floor if you need to. Bend the left knee, bring the left knee onto the floor, stretch out the left toe, resting on your feet, slowly come up, and slowly raise your hands from the both the sides up towards the sky to Anjane Asana. Look up. Normal breathing. Feel the stretch in the middle part of the body, low back. Slowly bring your hands down. Twist your body to this side. And Sit on your right leg, left leg is stretched out. And if you can get the balance, bring your palms together, namaste. A little difficult to balance. Using the support of your hands, slowly come up. 
and swing to the left in the same posture on the left side. Using your hands, slowly turn towards the left, rest your right knee, stretch your right toe, and again, Anjaneyasana on the left side. Look up and hold the posture. Slowly bring your hands down to grab your left ankle. Or you can place your hands on this floor if you need more balance. Curl your right toes, stretch out your right leg, stretch out the left leg, and bring your forehead towards the left knee. Grabbing the left ankle with the left hand, slowly raise the right hand up towards the sky into Trikonasana on the left side. Inhale, slowly come up with the star posture, turn the left foot forward. Bend your knees and adopting chin mudra, come back into the goddess posture, bending the knees forward. Slowly come up straight, feet together. Hands up in the sky to palms facing each other, palms touching each other rather. Bend towards left side. Come up, bend to the right side, and release your hands. That sequence was one half of Chandra Namaskar Asana, Chandra Namaskar or Moon Salutation sequence. We started with the left side, now we are on the right side. We'll repeat it and then we'll go back to the left side with this. Get up Namaskar. Spread your feet or one feet apart. Raise your hands up, palms touching each other. Let's take a nice inhalation. Exhale, bend to the left. Inhale, come up. Exhale, bend to the right. Inhale, come up. Take your left leg out about three feet apart, bending the knees, come to a goddess posture. Inhale, come to the star posture. Exhale, bend left foot. Sorry, it should be right foot. Sorry, bend right foot. Right hand to the right ankle, left hand to the sky. Turn the right foot 90 degrees for more stretch. Bring your left hand to the right ankle on the floor. Bring your, bend your head, bring your forehead towards the knee, right knee. Bend the left knee, bend the left knee on the floor. Stretch out your left ankle. Come to Anjaneyasana on the right side. Look up. Bring your hands down. Bend the right knee. Into the balancing posture on the right side. Adapt Namaste. Using the support of your hands, shift to the left. Into the balancing posture on the left. Using the support of your hands, turn towards the left side into Anjani Asana. Resting your right knee, stretching out the right toes. And bring your hands up into the sky and look up. Slowly bring your hands down, grabbing your ankles, 
uh, placing your palms on the floor. Stretch out the right leg, stretch out the left leg. Head towards the left knee. With your left hand, grab the left ankle. Slowly raise your right hand up towards the sky into Trikonasana on the left. Inhale and come up into the star posture. Turn the left foot forward. Give a nice double stretch in star posture. Bending the knees, adopt the goddess posture. Bring your feet together, hands up towards the sky. Take a nice inhalation. Exhale, bend to the left. Inhale up. Exhale to the right. Inhale up. And release your hands. Relax for a few moments. Standing relaxation posture, hands away from the body, feet away from each other, head down. And observe your breath. Observe all the, all the muscles that we stretched. Let's do one more round of Chandra Namaskar or Moon Salutations. Again, starting from the left side of your mat. Take one foot, both the legs, raise both the hands up, palms touching each other. Take a nice inhalation, exhale, bend to the left, inhale up, exhale to the right, inhale up, inhale, take your right leg out into goddess posture. Keep breathing normally. Into the star posture. Straighten, straighten your legs. Exhale, bend to the right side, right hand to the right knee, right ankle. Left hand up towards the sky. Turn your right foot for more stretch. Slowly bring your left hand to the right ankle. Bend the right. Uh, bending the head, try to bring the head towards the left, right foot rather, right knee. Bending the left knee, place your left knee on the floor, stretch out the left toes, come to Anjanayasana on the right side. Placing the hands on the floor, using the support of your hands. Shift to the right side balance. And adopt Namaste. Using the support of your hands, shift towards the left. For balance. Balancing posture. Using the support of your hands, turn towards the left, place the right knee on the floor, stretch out the right toes, Anjaneyasana on the left side. Bring your hands up, palms stretching each other. Slowly bring your hands down, place your hands on the floor or grab your ankles whichever you're comfortable with. Straighten the right knee, right leg, and straighten the left leg, forehead towards the left knee. Grabbing the left ankle with the left hand, raise your right hand up, Trikonasana on the left side. Inhale, come up into the star posture. Turn your left foot forward.
We left Devi Asana, goddess posture. Knees pointed forward. Inhale, bring your feet together, hands up towards the sky. Exhale, bend to the left. Inhale, up. Exhale to the right. Inhale, up. And release. Take a few deep breaths before we continue to the other side. When you're ready, start with sitting, palms together, feet together. Spread your feet about one feet apart. Inhale, raise both the hands up, palms touching each other. Exhale, bend to the left. Inhale, up. Exhale, bend to the right. Inhale, up. Inhale, take your left leg out about three feet apart into the goddess posture, knees pointing forward. Keep breathing normally. Stretch your legs, palms facing down into star posture. Exhale, bring your right hand to the right ankle, left hand up towards the sky. Trikonasana on the right side. Turn your right foot 90 degrees for more stretch. Slowly bring your left hand to the right ankle and bend your head to bring your forehead to the knee, right knee. You may use your hand support for balance. Turn your left foot. Bring your left knee on the floor. Stretch out the left toes. Come up into Anjaneyasana on the right side. So leaving your hands down, using the support of your hands, bending the right knee, balance on the right side, and up namaste. Again, using the support of your hands, shift your balance to the left, bending the left knee, balance on the left side. using the support of your hands. Turn to the left, place your right knee on the floor, stretch out the right toes, Anjane Asana on the left side. Slowly bring your hands down. Using the support of your hands, stretch out the right leg, Stretch out the left leg, head towards the left knee. If you feel comfortable, you can grab your ankles, sorry, left ankle. Grabbing the left hand, left leg with the left ankle, left ankle with the left hand, raise the right hand up to the corner of the on the left side. Nice expansion to the chest. Inhale, come up to star posture. Turn your left foot forward. Bending the knees, adopt the goddess posture. Straighten the legs, bring your feet together. Hands up, palms touching each other. Take a nice inhalation. Exhale to the left. Inhale. Exhale to the right, inhale up, and release. Relax for a few moments in standing relaxation posture. Feet away from each other, hands away from the body. Head down, close your eyes.
and observe the changes. Moon salutations is a sequence of postures with several asanas as a part of it. Observe all the changes, all the muscles we stretched. Gently open your eyes. Come to a sitting position. Start with sitting relaxation posture. Sitaladara. Dandasana. Let's do Chakki Chalan. Spread your feet, spread your legs as wide as you can. Grabbing your palms together, cross your fingers. We'll start from the left side. Make big circles with your hands. Exhale forward, inhale backwards. Try to make as big a circle as possible without bending your elbows. Go back as much as you need to. Draw 10 circles with your hands. Reach further with each exhalation. Opposite direction. So let's start the practice. Relax for a moment. Pressing the palms on the floor. Take a nice inhalation. As you exhale, stretch out your hands slide on the floor as much further as you can. Inhale back. So let's start the practice. Bring your feet together. Next practice we will do is knee rotation. Grab your left leg below the knee, bend your left knee, and make big circles with the left leg. Five times clockwise, five times counterclockwise. With your hands, grab your left leg or left toes. And try to stretch your left leg. At 45 degrees. Try to straighten your left knee if you're able to. Finally, let's hold the posture. If you're not able to reach your toes, you can grab your left leg like this and hold it at 45 degrees. Keep breathing normally. Slowly bend your left leg and release. Let's repeat the same thing on the right side. Grabbing below the right knee, make big circles with your right leg. Five times clockwise, five times anti clockwise. Grab your toes and stretch out right leg. Inhale and stretch. Exhale, bend.
do a few times and then we'll hold. Finally, inhale and hold. Keep breathing normally. So they bring your right leg down. Relax for a few moments. Let's see the Dandasana. Let's do Paschima Uttanasana, forward bend, seated forward bend. Feet together, hands by the side. Inhale, raise both the hands up, arms facing forward. Give a nice stretch. We'll do a few forward bends before we hold the posture. Take a nice inhalation. Exhale, bend forward, reach further. Inhale, up. Exhale, bend forward. Inhale, up. Exhale, inhale, try to bend from the low back region. The next exhalation, bend forward and grab your toes. Try to bring your forehead to the knees. Stay as long as possible, comfortable. Keep breathing normally in the final posture. Try to get more stretch with each exhalation. Release your hands. Inhale, come up. And exhale, release your hands from the side. Relax for a few moments. Sitting relaxation posture. The next posture we'll do is a Gomukasana, cow face posture. Bend your left leg at the knee, left knee pointing forward. Bend your right leg at the knee, right knee pointing forward. Right knee over the left. Right foot on the left side, left foot on the right side. Slowly take your left hand behind your back, use your right hand to pull it up. Inhale, raise your right hand up and exhale. Take your right hand behind you, grabbing your left hand with the right. If you cannot reach all the way, you can use the support of a towel for more stretch. Stay in the posture. You can close your eyes if you feel comfortable and keep breathing normally in the final posture. Stay as long as comfortable. Feel the nice expansion to the chest. Gomukasana, cow face posture. Slowly release the grip. Inhale, raise the right hand up. Slowly bring it down, release your left hand, release the right leg, and release the left. Let's repeat the posture on the other side. Bend your right knee, right foot to the left side, bend the left leg at the knee, left knee over the right, 
left foot on the right side. Sit comfortably. So you take your right hand behind you. Use the left hand to pull it up as high as you can. Inhale, raise left hand up. Exhale, bring your left hand behind you. Try to grab it. Right hand with the left hand. Stay there as long as you feel comfortable. Keep breathing normally. Observing the stretch. Slow, deep inhalation, exhalation in the final posture. Inhale, slowly raise the right hand up and bring it down. Raise your left hand. So I raise the right hand. Take in the left knee. Take in the right knee. And relax in Shitala Dandasana, sitting in relaxation posture. Slowly lie down on your mat. Lie down into Shavasana. So let's do Navasana, the boat posture. Have you both the hands by the side, palms facing the floor. We're going to raise both the legs and upper body, up to head all the way up to the low back, both at the same time with the inhalation. We'll do a few inhalation and exhalation before we hold the posture. Inhale and raise, exhale down. So you're balancing on the the low back in the middle part of the body only. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. So with the next inhalation, we'll hold the posture and stay in the posture with normal breathing. Inhale, hold the posture. If you need more balance, you can grab your legs with your hands. Now, asana, the boat posture. Tighten your core muscles. And stay as long as comfortable. Exhale. Bring your feet down, bring your head down, and relax. Slowly take your head, hands all the way above your head, bring your feet together. We we'll do Abdahalasana, half flow posture. Bring your feet together. We'll try with one leg at a time and then we'll hold it with both legs. <coughs> Inhale, raise the right leg up 90 degrees. Seal down. Inhale, left. Seal down. Continue. Continue a few times, alternating right and left. Now let's do it, both the legs together. Now let's do a variation of this. So as you exhale and bring your feet down, try not touching the floor, <clears throat> leaving your feet at about 15, 20 degrees from the floor. Take 
hit in the core muscles. Do five times and rest. You feet on the floor, do another five times and rest again. So we'll bring your feet down, relax for a moment. Then we'll get into the Ardhaharasana and hold the posture. Inhale and raise both the legs up 90 degrees and hold the posture. Keep breathing normally. Exhale. Bring your hands down. Relax for a few moments in Shavasana. The next asana we'll do is the lumbar stretches. So leaving your hands up to the shoulder level, arms facing the floor. Bend your legs at the knee, bring your heels as close to your back as possible. Take a nice inhalation. As you exhale, bend the knees to the right, and head to the left. Inhale, back to center. Exhale, knees to the left, head to the right. Inhale, back to the center. Continue a few rounds at your own pace. Cross your legs, right over left, and continue a few times. For more stretches. Switch your legs, left over right, and continue. Don't disturb the practice. Raise your feet, bring your feet, legs down, bring your hands down, and relax in Shavasana. Hands away from the body, feet away from each other, and close your eyes. Observe all the changes. Take a few deep breaths. Let's do DRT or QRT rather, quick relaxation technique. Collapse your whole body weight on the floor. Let there be no tight spots anywhere. Slowly bring your awareness to your toes. Slightly move your toes. Relax the soles, heels, ankles. Relax the entire right foot and left foot. Relax the calf muscles. Relax the knees, knee joints, and kneecaps. Relax the thighs and hamstrings.
Relax the hip joint. Relax the low back region. And relax the pelvic region and abdominal region. The entire lower part of the body is completely relaxed. To enhance the relaxation, let's produce the akara sound, uh, sound once. Feel the vibrations of akara resonate in the lower part of the body. Take a deep inhalation, inhale. Uh, Feel the nice vibrations of akara resonate in the lower part of the body. Bring your focus to your abdominal region. Observe the abdominal movements as you inhale and exhale. Relax the middle back. Relax the upper back. Relax the rib cage. Relax the chest region. And feel the heartbeat. Relax the neck region. Shoulders and shoulder joints, biceps, triceps, elbow joints, wrist joints, and palms. Slightly move your fingers and relax. Feel the entire middle part of the, part of the body completely relaxed. To enhance the relaxation, let's produce the ukara sound, sound as we exhale. Take a deep inhalation. Ooh. Feel the vibrations of ukara in the middle part of the body. Bring your awareness to your throat. Moisten your throat by swallowing a little bit of saliva. Relax the jaws, chin, cheeks, mouth, nose, eyes, eyeballs. Relax the temples. Relax the back of your head on the floor. Relax the crown of your head and relax the forehead. Slowly bring your awareness to your third eye position in between your eyebrows above your nose. Mentally scan the whole body from the heels to the back of your head from the toes to the top of your head. In the nice relaxation in every part of the body. Let's slowly come out of the Shavasana. Slide your hands on the floor, along the floor all the way above your head. Give a nice leisure stretch. Bending the knees, slowly turn towards the right side. Keep the head on your right hand, and left hand on the body. Using the support of your hands, slowly come up to a sitting posture.
Let's do a few pranayama practices. Starting with Kapal Bhati. If you are already familiar with Kapal Bhati, you can start the first round. If you need instructions, you can observe me. Place your right hand on your abdomen. Adaption mudra on your left hand, touching the tip of your thumb and index finger. Other fingers are straight. So in Kapal Bhati, we will do forceful exhalation. We will do the contraction of your abdominal muscles inwards. And while contracting, we will force out the air out of the lungs in a forceful exhalation in a quick jerk, like this. So the only part of the body that is moving is the abdominal region. You're using only your palm just to observe the movement. You're not pushing with your hand. Okay, you don't need to press it if you're comfortable. So we'll do one every two seconds and continue up to 30 times in one round. Start the first round. Stop with a long exhalation. <coughs> Observe the changes after, after Kapalabhati. When you're ready, once your breath gets normalized, continue with the second round. Stop with a long exhalation and observe Kevala Kumbhaka, a state where you don't feel the urge to breathe in. Allow your breath to get normalized. And after that, we can start the next pranayama practice, which is alternate nostril breathing. Nadi Shuddhi Pranayama, Dap Nasika Mudra, bending on the right hand, bending by your index and middle finger. We're going to use the thumb and the ring finger. The thumb close the right nostril and exhale from the left nostril. Slow and deep inhalation from the left nostril. With the ring finger, close the left nostril and open the right nostril and exhale from the right nostril. Slow and complete exhalation. The thumb close the right nostril. Sorry, you have inhale first. Inhale from the right nostril. Close the right nostril and open the left nostril. Exhale from the left. So this is one full cycle. Inhale from the left, exhale from the right, exhale from the right, inhale from the left. Continue up to six rounds at your own pace.
<clears throat> the next explanation from the left side, you can stop the practice. Let's end our session with one round of Omkar, followed by the closing prayer. Bring your palms together, Namaskar Mudra. Inhale. Closing prayer, Shanti Mantra, peace prayer. Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha, Sarve Santu Niramayaha, Sarve Badrani Pashyantu, Makas Chit Dukkha Bhag Bhave, Om Shanti Shanti Shanti. May I all be happy. May all be peaceful, may all be healthy, let there be no suffering. Place your hands, take your hands behind you, holding the right fist with the left hand, make a gentle fist with your right hand. As you inhale, take your head backwards, stretch your back. Exhale, bend forward, bring your forehead to the floor. Thanking the great divine and thanking the yoga master. Inhale, slowly come up. Release your hands, rub your palms, make them nice and warm. Place them around your eyes and pants for the warmth. Again, rub your palms. Give it a gentle massage to your forehead, face, and neck. Put your palms in front of your eyes, looking towards your palms with a few blinks up in your eyes. Namaste. <clears throat>